why people a lot and in our tour in Europe I mentioned that I was uh, honored to be part of uh, a parliamentary delegation that just returned from Brussels, Paris and London. A lot of people were also shocked there because they know Bahrain, they've visited Bahrain, they've seen Bahrain. This is not the Bahrain that they know. And they always asked us, what happened? How can the same people that we know for decades suddenly turn? When we showed them the videos, when we showed them the documents, when we showed them the photos, when we showed them some of the evidences of foreign interference and supports to these extremist people, they recognize that yes, it is not the Bahrainis. It is this small group element of Bahrainis that hijacked what was very normal democratic expression of better life. They hijacked it. And I think the world today recognizes that the leadership of Bahrain and the Bahrain, Bahrainis as people, were very wise, very wise in handling this situation. We are able in a peaceful atmosphere that we can transport, trans, uh, uh, have a normal life uh, in our schools, normal lives in our universities, normal life. The economy is back again to its normal normalcy. And to isolate this extremist group from the bulk of the population. And I am confident now that His Majesty the King and the leadership of Bahrain, and he said it over and over again, will continue with his development program of Bahrain, with giving Bahrainis a more democratic uh, society in coming future, but we have to work together, we have to put our hand in His Majesty's hand in achieving the objective that he has for the people of Bahrain, making Bahrain a role model of democracy in Middle East. And I'm extremely confident because I'm, I've seen, I lived through the period 14th of February to today. And I've seen how we handled it. And uh, I've been in the parliament, I've been with the leadership, I've been with the industry, and I'm 100% confident that everybody means, uh, wants, and have the well-being of Bahrain and its people at the top of their priority, without exception. And now, with the isolation of the extremists, I think our progress will be even better and faster uh, in the coming years.